Scooter View. Hello, everybody. Fox 2016 here, and welcome to the Food Review. All right, so I gotta go and uh, actually get the food. You know what? I have a plan, actually. You know, it fits, uh, it's on theme for today. I can do that. I can't do it with a lightsaber, but I can do it with a wand. Do a little spin. I'm not very good at it, but ache your bag. Magic. It's so it's so cool. You don't even know how I did it. You don't even know how I did it. Well, let's see. So it should be right in here. What we're reviewing today. Chocolate frogs. Oh, ah, can you can you see that? Yeah. All right. Let's get this done. All right. So here we go. We got this. So we're gonna open this up. So this is half of the fun. And we did it, guys. Oh, we're halfway there. So this is milk chocolate with crispy rice. This is a. I believe this is official. Um. Now there's two official types, I believe. Um. Oh, there's the new character, kind of looks like. I don't, I don't even know. Um, wow. Okay. Sorry, uh, I did not script this beforehand. Uh, but there, I believe there's two different types of official ones. There's these ones, which you'll usually find in the store, and then there's the Universal Studios ones, which I don't think are that as common. Uh, but you can find them at Universal and I think maybe a couple other places, I want to say. Uh, but uh, I'm not sure, 100%. I haven't, like, figured it out. But the those ones are served in cases that look, and the cards are, like, diet, or, like, hexagonal, and they're, like, more like the movies, whereas these ones are just easily packaged, easily thrown in there. The cards are card-shaped. Uh, but they both do share the same f functionality of moving, and I got Gryffindor, actually. I'm, I don't, I'm not even making that up. I got my house, I got, guys, I got my house, we, uh, origin, whatever, house founder. What, what did they call themselves? Look, I got my house founder. Now, this one was bought at Universal Studios, and that's, it was, this put me back $140. And I'm not, or like 200 I don't even remember now. Uh, and so, you know, when, when faced with the, like, Star Wars ones with the same price, I was like, I already spent it on this one, because I bought this day one, or day two. I'm go gotta go off the vlog days, not theme park days. You know, so here we go. So, the, half of it is, half of the fun is the card, and this, these are 3D printed, I don't know if you guys can see. Not 3D printed, but you know what I mean, they got, like, the 3D functionality on them. So, as you can see, when I do this... He moves around and stuff. One of the four founders of Hogwarts. One of the four famous founders of Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Witchcraft and Wizardry. Blah, blah, blah. Sorry. Witchcraft and w Wizardry. <laughs> Gretchen Gryffindor was the most accomplished dueler of his time, an enlightening fighter against muggle discrimination, and the first owner of the celebrated sorting hat, which I don't believe makes an appearance on the card, just the sword. Now, I don't think this character ever makes an appear any physical appearances in the movies. So, it's uh, that's the thing. Is they'll cast random people as these characters. And sometimes they'll just make up, make up stuff to just put on it. For example, the newest card is some guy Woodcroft. When is Woodcroft even mentioned? I don't... Is that, like, a real place? British people, tell me in the comments if this is real. I'm an American insulting your culture in a spinny chair with its really cute, really, really cute, um, cat themed, um, letter opener. <laughs> I'm trying to think of what it's called. It's not a remover, it's an opener. Uh, that's not mine. I'm in, I'm in someone else's house. In my grandma's house, it's fine. This is where I record my food reviews, uh, in the kitchen mostly. I forgot the milk. Akio milk. Magic. Life is magical and beautiful and the power of editing. Like, look at this dragon over here. And over there. And look, it's a unicorn. And look, it's Harry Potter himself. 
I'm not gonna edit any of those in there. Because <laughs> I'm too lazy. Watch me edit one dragon. One, like, tiny dragon move it across the screen. And <laughs> not even do that. Well, you know, we did the magic. We've done, we've done a lot of magic in this. I'm gonna get arrested now. Um, but, got the chocolate frogs. You got the normal milk. Good stuff. And we got our house leader card. Coincidentally, this is not like a scripted part of the video. What makes appealing about that sound? I don't know why. Oh, the whole card is holographic uh, 3D thing. I don't know what it's called. I'm sorry, I'm looking. Okay, no, no. Here we go. Here's the chocolate frog itself. Okay, I think it's Mr. Good Bar is what it's called. The crispy one, which is the crispy Hershey bar that they make. They now come in minis. Yeah, if you had the rice crisp, the crisp rice chocolate bar, if you've had one, you have them all. But it's still pretty good. It's definitely the brand and the cards that like carry it for this price. Because it's a lot smaller than your average candy bar. I should have showed you its size. Ah, whatever. <laughs> it's like an 8 out of 10. I don't like taste alone. Sit there and watch me awkwardly eat it. Hold on. Join the dark side. Do it. <laughs> There's Star Wars food out there. Tell me about it. Comment about Star Wars food. I would love to do a video on Star Wars food. Or my Harry Potter food. If you guys want to see me do like the uh, the jelly beans, or I've seen you come out with um, hmm, with chocolate wands. Which are interesting, but I wonder if you guys want to see me review them because I don't really know about them. I just keep seeing them in stores. Also, is that from, like, the books and movies, or is that, like, I've read all the books, don't worry, but I don't really remember chocolate wands as much as I remember, like, chocolate frogs and butterbeer, which I did try, and you can find that in the vlog, because I already did that review of it. Here's the same thing with green blue milk. Green milk's better. I mean, white milk is here, too, but, like... It, white milk is the worst one. Green milk's the best one. Blue milk is in the middle. <clears throat> Our slush never broke a bone would be proud of me for making the milk tier. I'm gonna make the milk tier list. Oh, uh, maybe. Someday. So damn it's really cute. Look at that. It's like a little, it's a little cat. Look at that. Okay. Meow. You opening up a letter. You open up a letter. Cat. Oh, it's not sharp, by the way. In case you guys were wondering, it is not sharp. Like, it barely even made it through there. It's not sharp. I'm safe. Okay. I don't play with knives. I just play with cute little cat based objects. <laughs> Wait, was that it? No, it's not. It's the other way. 
Well, I mean, if you're muted in a Zoom meeting, what else are you going to do but... Ow. Oh, all right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the review. Give me a comment down below. Give me food to try. Food that I can easily find. You know, I got like a five below that I can go to. I do the Wonder Balls, sometimes the Mario Wonder Balls. I got plenty of other types of candy there too that come with little toys. I love it when it comes with something else, with something small. Kinder Eggs are a big one too. But um, I once did do a Kinder Egg review, but that's never being released. It wasn't good. It's like a couple of years ago. It was, a, it was before I started these reviews, for real. I also have a scrapped review of uh, the Back to the Future chocolate bar at Universal uh, that I filmed in the hotel, but it was 1 a.m. So maybe I'll go back and edit that soon. Uh, but I'll see you guys in the next one. And uh, give me more stuff to try. All right, I'll see you guys.